Vsauce, Kevin here. But in my head, where am I? I think my consciousness is me, and it feels like a bead floating and shifting inside my head. When I wake up, the bead appears, centered, rested, ready. Time to go. Let the dog out, brush teeth. My limbic cortex tells me it's time to eat, so I make breakfast. The bead hovers behind the back of my eyes. Energy drink, focus, computer. The bead locks against the front of my skull. My prefrontal cortex, proportionally larger in humans than any animal in the world, is considering my future. Work hard today, prepare for tomorrow. The bead is pressing against the front of my head like it's determined to burst through. There are no distractions. This is my maximum attention. I am in the moment. I am here. Until I'm not. Distraction sinks in. Check Twitter, check Facebook, check clock. The day is getting away. I have to go to the store. An activity that seems to cause the bead to drift further and further back. To disconnect. Just get the stuff on the list. Avoid eye contact. I recede further back into the recesses of my mind. Almost mindless. It's like my eyes become windows and I'm peering through them at a great distance. Seeing people. Wondering who they are. What impossibly complex and somehow remarkably simple journey are they on? What's the bead in their head doing right now? What's the bead in your head doing right now? I return home. It's time for sleep. A time where I lose control of the bead and it goes somewhere without me. Storing, organizing, and recounting the events of the day. And then, before I know it, I awake. Vsauce, Kevin here. But where am I? And as always, thanks for watching.